by the moon and the sun You are one more than gold Like the stars in the sky You are one more than diamond More precious than silver Special kind of woman yeah. Yeah, mama gave You're a righteous woman. Makana is the one you do call. You're a righteous woman. My kind of is the one you do call Oh, my mama give up Baby, my girl Go see you for the day You're a faithless woman My kind of is the one you do In a day like this, in the month of May, 25 years ago, an angel was born in a human form into the family of late Pa James Obuako. That angel came into my life, brought joy, love, an inexplicable joy. As you mark your day today, may the light that illuminates from you shine forever. Happy birthday, my queen. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're Thank you so much, baby. Mm -hmm. Thank mm -hmm. you. What? Cannot explain how happy I am. Thank you. I love you. So thank you, Mary. I love you more. I love you more. Mm -hmm. So now, mm -hmm. we are going to cut your cake. Okay. But before we do that, we will spell your name. Sure. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. I. I. That's I. <laughs> F. U. N. A. N. Y. Hey! I have, you don't have to thank me. You are the best. And you are the best. Hmm? Mm. So, get ready, okay? Get ready, that's not the end. It's your day, my queen. Yeah, yeah. So everything you want, you will have it. Mm -hmm. You've always had everything you wanted anyway. <laughs> All thanks to you. Oh yes, my queen. And all thanks to you for loving this man right here. <laughs> <laughs> my queen. Okay. Are you scared? <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank Once you. Once again. 
There you go. I'll have this. Yes. Cheers. Okay. So, cheers to long life, prosperity, togetherness forever. And ever. And ever. Tastes good. Mm -hmm. Over you. <laughs> so, my queen, mm -hmm. this is not the end, okay? I have a surprise for you. What? You, really? Mm -hmm. What's the surprise? Oh, come on, if I tell you, it won't be a surprise anymore. What is it now? What is it? Okay, I'll tell you, but first you have to get ready. I'll be outside waiting for you. I should just get ready and it's up. I have sure. somewhere to take you, so dress up. Hmm? I will right now. Just right in. <laughs> Give me a minute. Okay. okay. Thank you, baby. It's my queen's day. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Hello, are you ready? Yes, I am. Mm. Look at my woman. You look stunning. Thank you, handsome. Oh. You know, you are the most beautiful I've ever seen in my entire life. For real. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Thank you. Wonderfully made for me alone. <laughs> okay, come here, Your Majesty. Let's go. Are you okay? Huh? Are you sure? Are you okay? Are you Nothing. Your wife is pregnant. Yeah. She's five weeks gone. What? Well, it, it, it's a good news. It's a good news. Um, sounded like what we want to hear. Yeah. But you see, Frank. My wife has taken in so many times, which you know. But she hasn't had this kind of experience before. Because this pregnancy is a special one. Hmm? Again, your wife is going to have babies now. Yeah. She's carrying twins. Babies. Congratulations, man. Babies. <laughs> How am I sure this will not end like the others? Oh, come on, my love. You don't have to sound negative. But we have to sound positive and hopeful. You are talking as if I have not been positive all this well. For Christ's sake, this is my sixth year in marriage. And within the six years, I have had five miscarriages. The 
doctors have confirmed us to be clinically fit to bear children, so I don't know where we went wrong. I have taken all medications, followed all instructions given, but there is still nothing to show forth. Baby. Baby. I, I, I am human and I am bound to feel confused and helpless. I know. It's not your fault. And I'm not complaining. I, I promise you, all we have to do is to have faith. Okay. By God's grace, all of these challenges will stop and we will have our own babies. Nothing will happen to these twins. If you calm down, hmm? you don't need to entertain panic. You don't need to entertain panic. I give you my word this time. I am going to take proper care of you. Nothing will happen to these babies. Mm -hmm. You give birth to them and you carry them. Yes. Congratulations, Mami Juma. <laughs> Mother of twins. Smile, we are having babies. We are having our own twins. <laughs> hmm? Come on. Sharp shooter. Be hopeful, hopeful, hopeful. <laughs> Sharp shooter. Hey, why you want? Freaky. Why you want? <laughs> Frank, my good friend, you've always been there for me and my family. Thank you so much for always coming whenever I call on you. I appreciate. Oh, thank you. Nothing. It's nothing. It's nothing. Um, it came here for now. Ndi busi ni fada ke bona di. Mo kwa no yon e mo 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 me ne bo 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 be. Hmm. I am a medical doctor, and I still believe some case could be spiritual. I know of a certain man whose wife had similar case of miscarriages, but it was solved by a spiritualist. My brother, I will advise you, since medical efforts towards this situation of miscarriages has failed, why not seek spiritual assistance? Uh, uh, Frank, 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 please, please. You of all people should know that I am not interested in any spiritual case. Anything spirituality, going to social places for, I don't need, I don't even do. You should know me by now, now. Huh? See, I believe Whatever that is happening is God's plan. Tell me any of any friend spirit. What was spiritual? All right, that person okay. has his own life to live. I have my own life to live. Fine, fine, fine. I've heard you. Hmm? Please, I'll be going now and I'll come back shortly to get the drugs that will help her. And please don't forget, she should not expose herself to any kind of hard work. That, that will not be a problem. I will ensure that. It's all right. Mm? Thank you very much. Please come back on time. No, I shall wait. Thank you. All right. Boys? Uh -huh. No girl. Please, a boy and a girl. No, a boy 
and a boy. A boy and a girl. A boy and a boy. No, you will see now. A boy. brown skinned boy <laughs> and a yellow skin. Mm. Welcome. Welcome. Always glued with each other like bread and butter. Oh, Baba, she's sitting. You met us well. Please come and join us. Welcome. Thank you. Love it. Don't eat. Huh. I feel that I don't eat. Okay. Thank and then you. there's watching her height <laughs> and her weight. Then they can eat the cake and their milk. They are fine, no. Oh. They are fine. Yeah. If not, are you alright? Your looks have changed. Mm. You are pregnant. Hey! Oh, well. I'm right. I knew it. You are pregnant. Hey? Hey! I knew it. Hey! Chiwa! Chiwa! Eh? If you my beautiful wife. Eh? Why you catch us in my? Oh, I Anyways, you know, and that brings me to the reason why I'm here. He came. You know, you are my only brother, and I know the kind of life you live. But it's not wise for a man that has problem to depend on one source for solution. This is six years of your marriage. And this if Nana's constant miscarriages. It's not something we should look at physically alone. You know? We have to go spiritual. Yes. And I know of a strong spiritualist that can deliver her from this problem. Yes, all, all you need to do is to allow her to follow me to the spiritualist. To do some prayers for her. Chukwa and if you don't want her to follow me, I can even invite you to the jo Adane. Uh, Nobody is coming here for any reason. Uh, Listen, I appreciate your concern, alright, towards my wife and I. But for visiting any spiritualist is a capital no for me. Uh, my wife will never in my entire life visit any spiritualist. Please, be cook and nayo. And let this be the last time you ever bring this issue in this house again. Biko. John is a spiritualist. Biko, 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 can you Why, you came? Why? You know you're the only hope for the continuation of our father's lineage. And I won't watch you remain childless. Because of your stubbornness and hatred for spiritualists. Eh? If they have casted a spell on you to refuse my wise counsel, more eh? I break it in Jesus' name. Amen. You are saying amen. Okay. And you, if Nanya, why are you always quiet each time I bring up this issue? As if it's more your business. Eh? Why? Okay. Since you don't want my advice, I am leaving. And I will still come back here eh, and solve this matter. Okay, Fronia, this ritualist, we will go together, we'll go and see him. Also, simple Sanya came. In a Christian, Mudan Wimam. Suggestion, Imam, will you? I don't know, Biko. Eh? Biko, 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 no, to go, please, it's okay. Oh, I don't know. It's okay, please. Oh, my mom, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. It's okay. Hmm? So we're having a boy and a boy. Thank <laughs> you. 
Mama, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mom. How are you? I'm fine, Mama. My beautiful angel. Um, Mama, I am pregnant again with twins. Are you serious? Hey! Hey, Juma. Twins? Oh, God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Eh? I am happy. What? I am seriously afraid. I fear what has been happening will happen again. Don't worry. Eh? Don't worry yourself. This one will stay. Yes. Nothing will happen to this one you are carrying. Nothing. Put your throat again. Well, you and I know I have tried all that the doctors told me, yet I lost other babies. Right now, I don't have confidence in the doctor's counsels and assurance. I just wish I could try another means of help and see if it would be positive. What are you planning? Many have advised my husband, including his sister, to see a spiritualist. But he has refused. My daughter, your husband is right. Yes, you see all these spiritualists, they will end up breaking your marriage. You will lose your husband though. Really? Eh. Uh, Please, don't do anything stupid. If I don't even go anywhere. Yes. Just calm down, oh? Nothing will happen to you. Do everything that the doctor says you should do. That is all you need. Okay, Mama. I have heard you. Uh, I will come and see you very soon, oh? And um, please take care of yourself, okay? Don't do anything hard, though. Don't do any hard job. Bye-bye. <laughs> Take care of yourself, oh? What is the problem? I hope all is well. Who are you? What are you doing with my bag of money? That is all I have. That is my life savings. get to your sister's house and discover that some things are missing. Mama, all the items you mentioned are in the bag. Eh. Mm. Let me run along. Right. Greet her for me, eh? Yeah, no problem. Take care of yourself, eh? Alright. Tell her I will come and see her soon. Mm. Mm. So much. 
Not your greetings. I don't need them. What's the problem? You are my problem, Miss Nanya. You are my problem. Ha! Me. How? Cut that hypocritical display of yours. I know your kind very well. Um, um, Mother needs to be honest. I don't understand what you are saying. Miss Nanya. So you plan to bring down my brother? My only brother, you can want them childless. I'm also blind, folded him from seeing the truth, if Nanya. What? Your secret has been made open. Abo Shara Gike! Tony, how can you accuse me of such a thing? You and I know how much I, I, I desire to give my husband children. For saying, children. <laughs> if Nanya, you're a liar. If your mission in Ikem's life is not to terminate his lineage, why have you not pressurized him to go and see a spiritualist that would deliver you from your spiritual entanglement, if Nanya? Eh? Sp spiritual entanglement? Hmm. Don't act as if you don't know what I'm talking about. That it was a spiritual entanglement with spiritual beings that have caused your womb not to carry a child. God forbid! Yeah? What did I hear you say? Eh? What did I hear you say, Adeni? You hear me right. I calculate and gather all the spiritual entanglement back to you in Jesus' name. Back to say now. They said to you. Then why am I about Adeni? Adeni, let me remind you that your brother married my daughter, Adam Jemono, as a virgin. And the doctors confirm her physically and spiritually okay. Meaning na anya be yanya. I hold the ya hoko from koshishi. Are you hearing me? So I will not have you come here and accuse my daughter of what she knew nothing about. See, let me tell you. You see this thing she's carrying. Hey, mommy, omo chago ya tijara. And there is nothing you can do about it. I'm not here. But God, how dare you stand in my presence and talk to me like that? Eh? Instead of apologizing for your daughter's failure as a wife. No way. Eh? Apo? Apo, give me. Eh? Apologize? To who? Give one. To me. Ada. Adi Beribe. Useless Ada, that is what you are. Adi Huriho. Look at you. So, Ndia Daputu, Wage, Pata Ewa. You should be ashamed of yourself. See, let me tell you. I will not have you leave your husband's house and come here to discomfort my daughter in her husband's house. May Maggie here. I will deal with you. I'm not here. I see. Yes. I see. Hmm. You don't grow wings to oh. talk back at me. There you go. Ada. I'm not going to be a I'm not going to be a boy. Okay. By this time next year, mm -hmm. if your useless daughter fails to give my brother, my only brother, he can one name, oh. a child, oh. I will bundle her out of this house. Oh. And you know I will do it. Please bundle I your useless it. self out of this useless compound. Self. Like mother, like I'm not here. But look, at look, at look at you. Look at you. Please calm down. 
I understand how you feel. Deep down I do. But I promise you, I will talk to my sister. I will not allow anyone discomfort my lovely wife. Please, not in this condition. Biko, I promise. Butu, oh, Butu. Talk to your sister. Oh. Talk to your sister. Oh. Talk to Adane. Oh. Hey. My daughter, please take good care of yourself and your husband. Eh? I will be on my way now. See me off, Pano. Stay here and take care of yourself. I will find my way. The situation is not bad that I can't take a walk again. Let me see you off. Hmm? Are Mama? you sure? Yes, Mama. Come. Adam, I respect you as my elder sister. And I also appreciate the fact that you are doing everything possible for my own good. Well accepted. But you see, coming to my house to instigate my wife on seeking for, 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 for fetish help is what I will not take. I will not take it for any reason. Whatever that happened today, Biko, let it be the first and last time it will happen. Please, avoid my wife and avoid my family. Ikim, I will not stop until you do the need for. You are a man and should not let your emotions cover your sense of reasoning. Yes. Thank God you know. Thank God you know I am a man. I am a man that has my family. Allow me to take care of my family the way I want to take care of my family. Allow me to handle my life and my wife the way I want to handle. You have your own life to handle. Please. Please. Biko can now, yo. Look at your mouth. Please, please, Biko, here I am. I will not stop. Ikem, behave like a man. If you are a man, if you call yourself a man, behave like one. What insolence? What insolence? What nonsense? Eh? You say you will not. Now look, you see the sand? I swear by our father's grave. Eh? If for the last time, you see the next time that rubbish will happen again, what I will do to you, eh? You will not. If I, you're going to ask yourself if it's your only brother that is doing this to you, I'm repeating myself. Avoid my family. Stop coming to my house to instigate my wife on seeking for for for, for fetish help, for seeking for some spiritual help. I'm, I'm, I'm begging you. If I come back here again, if I come back here again, eh? What I will do to you? What? I, Nana Maya. You, you, you think I'm joking? No, 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 you think I'm joking? Try it again. Try me again. If I come back here, eh? I will shock you. One day, nge yigegu. It's me, Adam. Nge yigegu. Nonsense. Ikem. Oba mwa wa, Adam nge. Ikem. Hey! I said it. If Unanya is a witch. Eh? Ikem, my brother want to beat me because of, because of a witch. Hey! Frank must hear this. Hey! Hey. Mama, are you serious about what you just said? Does she understand what my sister has been through all these years? And she had the guts to put her in one tension at a time like this, even without minding her present condition. What has come over her, Mama? The only thing that surprises me is why your sister will be going through such in the hands of that useless Adane, and she kept silent. Eh? If I had not gone there today, only God knows what would have happened. He would have slapped you or beaten you up. You know he has a bad temper. You do. <sighs> I still can't believe he came my only brother. Threatening to injure me because of that girl. It has become obvious that if Nana cast a spell on him, because the Ike I know won't think of laying his hand on me, if not, if not that he's under a spell. <laughs> Obviously, this misunderstanding has turned into a fight. I am ready for the fight. You see this fight that Nana is calling for? Hey, 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 hey. It will definitely consume her. I know that she's very stubborn. I know that 
dick him who talks to her. But the useless agenda that I know is very stubborn. Eh? If she dares madrid my daughter again in that house, eh, eh, I will put aside the respect I have for Ikem and deal with her. Mwaiba! Mama, calm down. Eh? It has not got into that. Urubrono, dear. How do you mean? What I mean is that it is time for you to let them be on this matter. I don't want this issue to get worse than it is already. Biko, let them be. Frank, can you hear yourself? Can you just hear yourself? We are talking about your best friend. He came one name. And you are telling me, let them be. How? Your best friend is drowning in this destructive water of arrogance and ignorance. And you are telling me to keep silent. Huh. I will not keep silent. Not while I still put. I will not. Adane, you are taking this matter too far. I may not like the result and effect. I don't care. Adane, do not dare me. You see this fight you are calling for? <laughs> it will surely consume you. That I promise you. Fight? Mama, are you sure you are not rather... Just shut up! Shut up! If you don't know what to say, shut up! Would you have In fact, stand up and go inside. Make my back! I'm very angry now. I want to think. I'm not watching one more. Imagine. Eh? My own daughter. I don't Hey! Hey!
I've picked it, man. Hey, 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 my in-law. Hello, my in-law. How are you? What? Hey, hey, hey. Mama, what is it? Hey. Oh, please talk to me. What is it? I will make a come. 
I will make hot tea, very hot one. I will fry egg. I will bring bread. I can even miss Kobo jollof rice for you. you. Just choose any. In fact, I'm coming. No need of wasting time. By the moon and the sun You are one more than gold Like the stars in the sky You are one more than diamond More precious than silver Special kind of woman You're a very just woman. Makana is the one you do call. You're you're a virtuous woman. My kind of is the one you do call. You're my Maggie, my boy. Gozi chuku vunkiki. You're a virtuous woman. My kind of is the one you do call. you're a virtuous woman. My kind of is the one you do. Chidi, what are you doing here? What's good morning? Why did you leave the shop to come here? Hmm? Okay. Hmm. Okay, you see? Are you mad? Do you want me to reset your brain? Why would you leave the shop and, 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 and the customers there? Are, are you out of your mind? Okay, the worst has happened. The worst. Oh, oh Mego. The worst has happened. Eh? What do you mean by the worst has happened? Okay. Why you? What happened? Eh? What happened? Okay, I should tell you. Why you? Why you? Okay, I'm robbers. They broke into our shop. Eh? I was not sure. Eh? I'm robbers. Did what? They broke into our shop. They made away with all the money we made during the weekend. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Don't think it's me. Oh, I want my own shop. <laughs> hey! Hey! Okay. into pieces. The robbers took all the expensive items in my shop. Everything. Even the money the woman that supplies me red oil brought last week. They, they took the 200,000. And I'm supposed to supply her oil today. She's been calling me. I don't even know what to tell her. I'm not even picking her calls. No, what is happening to me? Eh? What, what, what is happening to my life? Became, frankly speaking, I am as surprised as you are. Seven years ago, you were one of the most successful business guys in this community. Exactly. First, 
Six years ago, your shop got bombed and not even a pin was picked out from that shop. And that same week, robbers stole my bike. My bike, barely three months old, they stole it from me. You raised money, you started again. After two years, the vehicle carrying your goose worth a lot of money fell into the river and nothing was picked out. Now, robbers broke into your shop and took all the valuables in your shop. Coupled with the fact that you've been married for six years without a child and there is no clinical or physical explanation to that. It came here for now. Is it not obvious to you? Is it not yet glaring to you that what is happening to you is no longer ordinary? Hmm? What you are going through has spiritual undertone. And I will suggest to you, in fact, I am advising you to seek spiritual assistance now. Hmm? It's only a tree that I heard that it will be cut off and stood there. You have to do something. Makanayaga no madam madu. Nese mo mo. Please. Shedding tears is not the right thing to do now. But a way out, looking for a way out, is the best thing to do now. Okonkwo, the only son of Okonkwo, you're welcome. Uh, how did you know my name? Live the night and the darkness, for the night is the eyes through which the gods sees the hidden mysteries. You've suffered problems, losses and misfortunes for the past six years. And the one responsible for your misfortunes. And your wife's miscarriages. Is order. Order. Uh, sorry. Who is order? He is the powerful and dreadful deity of war. Deity. He is the first and the rightful husband to your wife. If Nanya, your wife, has a spiritual husband, and other uh, is... Uh, uh, um, please, 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 please. I cannot sit here and watch you talk, talk about my wife in that manner. Which one is spiritual husband? Your stubbornness to the things of the spirit is the reason why you're in this mess. comes to your dreams to warn you but you see them as mere dreams a month before your shop got burnt he came to your dream and stripped you naked on the road Dress yourself and hand those clothes over to me right now. Now! Where you started from. 
go. I remember. A month before the vehicle conveying your goods fell into a Wani river, he came to your dream and forced you to walk under the rain. But you took them as mere dreams. And last month, he took your money. Yes. He took my money. He took, he took my bag of money. I remember. I, I, I remember. That is true. If not for your ignorance to the things of the spirit, you would have known that these were not mere dreams, but a very strong bad omen. Um, um, great one. I am. Um, I am happy. We are here and we are hearing the, 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 the truth from you. But please, what can he do to be free from the torment of this spirit? What? I, Ndeli, the goddess of the night, would save you and your wife from his torment. But you have to provide the things needed okay. for the cleansing. Okay. And come back in two days' time. Okay. We'll provide it. Fine. Um, great one, please. What are the hmm. what are the needed items? Hey! He came. What kind of temptation is this now? You mean he lost all the valuables in the shop? Everything. Hey! Mama, my husband has been through a lot lately. And it is seriously affecting him emotionally. Oh, what kind of temptation is this? <sighs> um, Adam, please. This is the time your husband needs you. Yeah? Try and show him love and care. In fact, don't even give him any room to think about what happened to him. Don't give him space. He'll always be with him at all times. Oh? I will try, Mama. I will try my best. And God will help you. Oh? Mm. I, I, I believe you. That one. He went out with his friends. Oh. Let me bring you something to eat. Oh. Um, let me give you food now. Oh. Just small food. You want no strength either, number oh. Please, just small. Let me get you. the weight of what happened to us but you are taking it too far and you are thinking a lot and that is causing more harm to yourself just imagine you did not even notice that I came in baby please I beg you get a grip on yourself all hope is not lost look we will definitely find a way out of this situation I know we lost a lot of money, but losing you is something I cannot bear. No, you will not lose me. Then, 
be strong for me. There is always a light at the end of the tunnel. Thank you. I love you. Otto, the spirits disturbing me came with me. Dealt with me. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. If I, Udeli, the powerful spirit of the night, cannot handle order, then I'm afraid no matter can do anything about it. So, uh, wise one, I'm sorry for the blow, everything. Eh? But is, is there nothing you can do again? The only way out is for you to divorce if Naya, your wife. Discontinue your relationship with her. Both as a husband and as a friend. That's the only way out. Now I believe that something is fighting my life and progress. It has become clear my wife has a spiritual entanglement. And that is the reason for our problems. But why will the spiritualist say divorcing my wife is the only way out? Why? No. I don't believe her. I will not divorce my wife. It's obvious she does not have the power to conquer the spirit fight in my family. I have to seek alternative help elsewhere as soon as possible. Pastor Titus, yes, I've heard so many powerful testimonies about that pastor. I think he can handle this. I'll see him tomorrow. ready or not. Such times come either to tear you or to strengthen you. But certainly tough times do not have the power to destroy you unless you permit it by succumbing to it. If you are a very strong woman the size of your problem is nothing compared to the ability you have to solve it. Do not overestimate your problem and underestimate your ability. When you are Ikem's wife, go home, sit down, put yourself together and you will see where the arrow is coming from. And then you strike back and take control of your territory. Tough time doesn't last. Only tough people do. Thank you so much, brother. Thank you. Your words have made me stronger. You're welcome. Come here.
brother. The God has done it again for me. <laughs> there is this my customer from Oko that's been owing me for over two years now. Called me this morning and demanded that I send my account number to him. Guess what? I sent him the account number before I could blink. He sent my money back to me. Even added extra. Oh my God. <laughs> this is... This is a miracle! Indeed, it's a miracle. You see, I was busy jubilating that the robbers that broke into my shop, that have recovered everything they stole from me. And the Lord blasted me again with this miracle. Frank, this is good news. Frank, I owe you a lot. No, 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 I no, owe no, you a... no, no, because it's you now. You have made me realize where my problem is coming from. What are eh? friends for? What are friends for? Like, I am very, very happy. I am delighted you are coming back to the usual. That you are coming back to the game that I know. <laughs> Thank you. And so, am I a doctor? I want to go and see Dr. Frank, but I don't have the strength. So, so can you take me to him? I think I am pregnant. <laughs> you think you're pregnant? <laughs> yeah. huh? So I should dance for you that you're pregnant. No, now let me dance for you now if Nanya is pregnant. Yeah? As if it's not the same pregnancy that you still lose in, in few weeks to come. Why are you looking at me as if I'm sounding surprising? Is it not the same pregnancy that you still lose? I, I should start celebrating or jubilating that, that if Nanya is pregnant. I, 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 I've, I've not seen... Please, 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 don't even provoke me. Oh. Don't provoke me. You're pregnant. Like I'm one in the pregnancy. Danne, asim ka kambia yogi. I'm here to apologize. All right. The way I spoke to you the last time, uh, it was uncalled for. Please, just let it go. Okay. Forgive me. Forgive me. Be go. Hmm. I have forgiven you long ago. You know you're my only brother. I cannot hold grudges against you because of your childish behavior. I'm forgiving you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh, indeed, blood is thicker than water. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you see, Adani, uh, just like you said, uh, I've, I've come to realize that I've been, you know, uh, living a childish behavior for, for, for the past, I mean, so many years now. I've lived with Ifunaya so many years now and nothing to show for it. No child. Uh, so now I have decided to take the bull by the horn 
uh, yes, I've decided to take another wife. Yes. <laughs> hey, Ikim. <laughs> I still don't understand you. Please, explain well. <laughs> and then Nanyago was a pay. I mean, this is what you've always wanted now. Uh, you've always wanted me to take another wife. So it's about time. There is no need wasting time. I've, I've tried. Uh, so now, hmm, I want to take another wife. Hey! Are you serious? You can... Hey! Ah! Chimo! Hey! Hey! <laughs> Cool down. Eh? I will give you a sweet young girl. Eh? That will massage you, pijas you. Eh? <laughs> hey! Man, no more. He came. Hey! Hello. I am so happy. Hey! <laughs> My brother, you have done well. No, I've, I've tried. Hey! I've tried. Mani Kwanan. Efnaya, please. Please calm down. Hmm? Worrying yourself over uh, this issue is not good for you at a time like this. Why are you acting as if you're not happy over your pregnancy? Frank, being pregnant is not my problem. My problem is my husband's recent behavior towards me. He came is no longer the man I married. He does not talk to me. He does not eat my food. He does not care about me anymore. He behaves as if I did something very bad to him. I have begged I have apologized on several occasions just in case I wronged him unknowingly. But he has refused to open up. Rather, he treats me like an enemy. Frank, could you believe that he came stood before me and said that there is no reason for him to be happy about my pregnancy? Because I will surely miscarry this child in a few weeks to come. He used my situation. He used my situation to make mockery of me. My husband. Ifunaya, please. My husband please. made jest of me. Ifunaya, please, 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 calm down. Hmm? I understand how you feel. I truly understand how you feel. Hmm? But please calm down. <laughs> Weeping like this is not good for you in your situation. I promise you one thing. I am going to talk to him on this matter. Whatever it is will be sorted out, please. to him, I beg you, please, please. Don't worry, I will talk to him. Hmm? I believe he will open up to me. I believe. Hmm? Come down, I believe. Thank you. Hope you take your medications. Yes, thank you very much. Everything will be sorted out. Thank you. It's all right, I, I will be on my way now.
I'm very sorry. I have not swept here yet. Sorry for yourself. Sorry for your stupid self. So you mean you've been lying down inside without sweeping the compound? Eh? So if I had come in here with a visitor, this, this rubbish is, 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 is what you said to me? Eh? Thank you, Mom. You, you know my condition. And I... Please stop, 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 stop that rubbish. Who's after your condition? What, what kind of silly condition is that? Eh? You think l l lying down in the house since morning w w w with such a condition? Is that what your dollar brain told you? Eh? If you like, don't go and look for a way to sort your problems. Don't go and look for a way to sort your problems! You, 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 know, you know my condition. C condition called permanently. Look for something and sweep this compound now. Let me not come out here and, 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 and meet this compound like this. Nonsense. I said look for broom and sweep the compound. Stop putting your hands like you want to receive Holy Communion. Who's after that rubbish? Just look at everywhere, looking so untidy. Don't make me angry. Oh. You know I'm not the only person here. Someone is here. Neto, I'm good. Rotate, Eremu, rotate, Eremu. Hi, Asa. With my sister. Good afternoon. Please hold your greetings. God forbid. I reject you and your greetings. Evil witch, evil woman. Are you? Before I was rudely interrupted. <laughs> eh, you can. <laughs> Let me introduce you to your <laughs> beautiful wife. Your new chassis. <laughs> Ego Ibo. <laughs> Offense, Salah. New wife? Yes, new wife. Queen <laughs> Sue. Uh, uh, he hasn't gotten to that point. Please come in. Hey, hey. let's go inside. Eh? Relax your mind. Hey. 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 She's the one I told you about. Oh. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Uh, what's your name? My name is Samara Egesimba. Egesimba. Sorry, I, I, are you related to one uh, Titus uh, Egesimba? Yes, sir. He's my dad. Oh. <laughs> I see. Really? Yes, sir. Well, you know Chief has four boys. And I'm right here. 
is the only top. <laughs> She's not just beautiful. <laughs> she is also a wife material. Eh? <laughs> And as you see her here, eh? Hey, she's loaded with handsome boys and pretty girls. <laughs> Just one touch. Hey! Obudia, she will give you twins. Ejima. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs> Ami. Hey. Well, uh, she's a beautiful girl. Yeah, she is. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. But no, she know her. You man, I don't know. I select this for you. <laughs> Unlike that bitch. <laughs> yes. I mean, uh, um, I'm I'll go inside. Eh? You know, both of you need to sit down and sort things out. I'm inside. I mean, the last, you are here to stay. Nobody will pursue you. I'm our damn nigga. But I don't. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you. Taking a second wife. Do you think I'm joking? You can't be serious. What about us? <laughs> us? Did you say us? Are you that daft or blind to notice that there is nothing like us anymore? We are done, woman. Like, done. D O N E done. You can please I beg you. Please don't do this to me. Don't. I understand how you feel. I am sorry. Please. You carried your child. And I know I will be this one for you. Please don't go this far. I beg you. <laughs> You're carrying my child. How many times have you carried my child? But is there anything to show for it? Absolutely nothing. L listen, girl, stop all of this drama and sympathetic nonsense. I mean it. I am done with you. And don't make it look like I am the one hurting you. Because you are the one hurting me. Since we got married, have you given me any child? No! You haven't given me any child. We are done. Go and search yourself while I do mine. If Naya, I can tolerate everything from you, but coming here to cry over a man, that is what Muabun Jideka will not take. In an ear. Wait, well, let me ask you. What are you still doing in that house? Eh? Mama, that man is legally my husband. You don't expect me to leave my marriage because we have issues. <laughs> Mama, that man is legally my husband. He don't expect me to leave. Can you hear yourself, Tom? If Naya, can you hear yourself, Tom? What marriage? Is that one marriage? Is that one a husband? Eh? He can make it crystal clear to you that he does not want you in that house. What are you still doing there? Why are you chingoming yourself on a man that does not want you? As if your life depends on that marriage. Eh? If a snake gives birth to a snake. Lion gives birth to a lion. I give birth to you. Behave like your mother, Sanya Mary. Wake up! Papa. Okay, then. You know, sometimes I don't understand you. 
You know I have a problem. My inability to give birth to children for it came is, is about breaking my marriage. Instead of you to help me find a solution, you are here advising me to, to, to leave my marriage. Is it fair? Hmm. Nem, you don't have a problem. Mm -mm. My daughter cannot have a problem. See, let me tell you. In fact, Kaiti was here kyo ibon sube. Let me tell you the truth because I know Ikem will not tell you. Ikem, your husband is the one responsible for all the miscarriages you've been having. What? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Hey, you don't know. Hey, he won't tell you now. But you will carry enemies of Njideka's progress. I know he will not tell you. See, he is a cultist. An occult man in the Ikea with a very big rank. Mama, Mama, please, it is not true. Eh? He is the one using your born children for sacrifice. No, Mama, please, I will not tolerate you talk about my husband like that. No, please, it is not true. It is true. It is not true. It is true. I said it is not true. Eh? Hey, you don't want to believe me because I'm your mother, eh? What is there to believe? It is not true. It is not true. Okay. Since you don't want to believe me, you will keep having miscarriages until you believe me. Mama! Okay then! Is that your plan for me? Mama, See, let me tell you. Your husband is a court man. Believe me, oh! Mama, it is not true. I am saying this because I need a grandchild. He is a court man. Believe your mother. Is not, it is not true. Leave my husband out of this. Eh? Hey. Do you believe me? Do you know, you know how Mama can be sometimes? Please do not take it to heart. Okay? Here, I was able to get some items, some cups of rice, peas, and gari, with uh, a bottle of red oil and granite oil. Please, manage it. Hmm? Since your husband doesn't give you money for feeding any longer, please, manage this. Hmm? Just be strong for me, okay? Juma, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, let me hurry home now. Okay, let me assist you with the bag. Thank you. It's a good thing that we're making progress now. Yeah. Yeah. So I have um, contacted my people, uh, my sister, my in-laws, my cousins. They really? all know right now. So yes. Oh. So we have fixed a date for the introduction. Oh, when are your people coming? Tenth of next month. Tenth of next month. I think that's two weeks from now, right? Exactly. Exactly. Oh my love. <laughs> I can't wait. Uh, if I like, please come. You see, I want you to listen and listen very, very good. As it stands now, my wife is going to sleep over. So I will appreciate that you pack your things. You know, go pack all your belongings, eh? And look for somewhere to go. Look for somewhere if it's there, you just look for somewhere to pack your things there. 
Because I don't want anyone to inconvenience her for me for any reason. You... I don't understand. Has it now gotten to the extent where you now chase me out of my matrimonial bedroom? Matrimonial bedroom? You don't understand what? Like I, ha I have water in my mouth while I'm talking to you. Eh? If Unanya, you no longer have the right as a wife in my life. In fact, in this house as a whole. Okay? So just look for somewhere and go and sort yourself. Please, don't inconvenience her for me. Biko. Just, what did I do wrong? Where did I go wrong? Because your spiritual husband wants to kill me. He wants to kill me for marrying you. Yes. Let me tell you now. He wants to kill me. He has crumbled my business. In fact, he has rendered me useless. So Biko, now that my life is still intact, please, I don't want any problem from any spiritual husband. Pack your things and just leave. Biko, let me use my life and, 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 and do something useful. What are you talking about? It is true. Frank, so it's been you all this while. So you have been the one deceiving and brainwashing my husband to leave me and find another woman to marry. Frank, are you such an ingrate? Is this how you pay me after everything I have done for you? If now you calm down and listen to me. Listen to what exactly? If you can calm down and listen to me, you will actually understand what I am saying. With the level of love Ikem has for you, do you think he will believe you have a spiritual entanglement if it was not confirmed? Who confirmed such rubbish? I did! Do you remember a certain man that always comes to your dreams? He claims to be your husband and he always takes advantage of you. Even though you resist, he always gets his way. My lovely wife. I am not your wife and will never be. I thought I have warned you never to come here again. So what are you doing here? <laughs> I have every right to come here whenever I want to see you because you belong to me. No, I do not belong to you. I am someone else's wife. So stop coming here to harass me. You call that fool your husband? And you call taking what is mine harassment? <laughs> I will, but not without having a good time with my lovely wife. Come, come to your husband. My wife, come to your husband. <laughs> Come to me. <laughs> yes, yes. He, he, he comes to me whenever I am pregnant. And once... He, he he rapes me. I, I always lose my pregnancy few days after. I, I could not tell my husband because I don't I did not know what it meant. But I told my mother and she said it's an ordinary dream and he has nothing to do with my miscarriages. She could not tell you the truth because she is afraid of the consequences. What, what 
consequences. Ten years ago, after your father's death, your uncle, Umadi, started dragging your father's land with your mother. A friend advised her to seek help from other, the deity of war. And she married you off to order in exchange for your brother's life. Oda, the deity of war, tormented your uncle, Umadi, till he confessed and died. This is not possible. So, no, wait. My mother, my mother is responsible for, for my problem. No, 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 it is not possible. No, my mother cannot be responsible, no. Your mother is not enjoying the consequences of what she did. But she can't tell you. What do I do, please? What do I do? How do I get out of this, please? There is nothing anybody can do about it. Not even I, Ndeli. Nobody can face the wrath of order, the deity of war. No. No, no. I cannot remain like this. No. I have to move away without you. You cannot fight him. Fight him with everything in me. Ikim tried fighting him. He sought for help from many men of God, strong pastors, priests and prophets, but none of them could separate you from order. Rather, order struck each of them with one helmet or the other. He almost took the life of Ikemefuna because Ikemefuna was looking for ways to separate you from him. That was why you found him unconscious the day you brought him to the hospital. I am sorry. I don't think you can fight this battle. much. I love you because you're my only daughter. And God in heaven knows that. I truly love you. I almost lost three of my sons in one year. at the fate of losing Chiba. Two of my sons left me. Two left me. I couldn't watch Chiba go. I needed to save him, to save your father's lineage. To save your father's name. And to also save me from the shame of losing three sons. Three. Hmm. I believe every other mother out there would have done what I did to save her husband's name. If I had any other option. I wouldn't have involved you, my daughter. I wouldn't have... I'm sorry for all the pains I caused you. I needed to save Chiba. To give you someone you can call a brother. Someone you can call your own. Please, I'm sorry for putting you through all this. 
this about my face, forgive me. Forgive me, your brother, forgive me, forgive me, become one, forgive me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> How do I get out of this? By the moon and the sun You are one more than gold Like the stars in the sky You are one more than diamond More precious than silver Special kind of woman Mama gave up Ngozi chuku vunkiki You're a virtuous woman Makana ezi wanyidi uko Mama gave up Ngozi chuku vunkiki you're a virtuous woman. My kind of is the one you do call. Oh, my mama give up. Baby, mama, go see you for a good day. You're a virtuous woman. My kind of is the one you do
have lost everything I live for. Choice of life. Chance to be a mother. And my only treasure. My husband. I am only left. In this virtual spiritual bondage. Mockery and shame. Of what use is life? All it has to offer is shame and sorrows. Just time to end it all. You are wrong. It's time to start it all. It's time to stand boldly and face your challenges. It's time to lift up your voice to heaven, screaming, enough is enough. I cannot be defeated. Who are you? I am David. understand what you're going through. But what you wanted to do was wrong. When I was carrying my problems on my shoulders, it got me nowhere until I started studying my Bible. And the Lord opened my eyes to see that it was not my duty to do the heavy lifting. Your problem is something only God can solve. If Naya, if I were you, I would get my heart right with God and fight my battles on my knees. If Naya, I see in you a great warrior that needs to be awakened. It's time to take charge of your life. It's time to kick that deity out of your life with the word of God. It's time to take charge of your life and marriage. Remember, the enemy comes to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But the Son of Man was made manifest to destroy every work of Satan. If man, the Lord is faithful. He will protect you from every evil. He will strengthen you. The Lord calls you to battle. Life itself doesn't get easier, we get stronger. The time is now. I see in you a great warrior that needs to be awakened. It's time to take charge of your life. It's time to kick that deity out of your life with the word of God. It's time to take charge of your life and marriage. Remember, the enemy comes to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But the Son of Man was made manifest to destroy every work of Satan. The Lord is faithful. He will protect you from every evil. He will strengthen you. The Lord calls you to battle. 
the time is now. your lies, your schemes and your accusations and live my life in Jesus' name. You can't have my marriage. You can't have my life and surely you won't have my husband. My life is under a new management and that means you are out. You are out! Today, I have found a new life in Christ. Just in case you have forgotten, he already defeated you. So go back to hell where you belong and leave my life alone. Nanya is not happy with the recent happenings in her marriage. Well, she cannot do this kind of thing to Kim. She can't. Don't underestimate her. She can do the unthinkable. I'm sure she has a hand in this. If Nanya has a hand in this. But I will show her. If Nanya, I will show you. <laughs> anyway, Frank, how is he came responding to treatment? The substance that entered his eyes is a very poisonous one. Though I have placed him on medication. But the medical possibility of him seeing with those eyes again are very, very slim. Huh? I'm telling you. Hey! If not for the grace of God, like aside the grace of God, I am not sure Ikemifna can see with those eyes again. Hey. Hmm. Hey. How do you mean you don't know? Uh, Mama, I don't know what you are talking about. I went to church early this morning. I just came in a few minutes ago. If Naya. Mama. Are you telling me that you don't know that your husband was attacked? Huh? Eh? My husband? By who? When? How will I know who and when? I overheard somebody saying it. But it's fine. Evil woman! Have a switch. So your plans to murder my husband, my brother, childless girl. That's what he said someone has to blind him. Hey! No, my only brother. He came one day inside the hospital. Blind! Are you here to help me? 
in pain. You already you dead. This house. You already a dead woman. Now again, foolish woman. Who is supposed to go? <laughs> eh? You hey. came to another woman's husband's house. My brother's house. So who really is to open a book and get her? If there is anybody to leave, it is you. Leave my daughter alone to enjoy her marriage. I do believe. I shall come back. Who are? I know here. Who are? Who are they? Yes. I see who are they. Who are they? I do believe. Who are they? Believe. I hear one. In no corner near. On top of it, you say I am barking like a dog. Mad me. I will do. teach you a lesson you will never forget in the hall. Hmm? You are leaving this house. Which house? If you don't leave. Which house? I have seen my venom on you. What's the venom? Leave this house. I have spilled the venom already on you. I have stuck on here. Onyara! Come on! Get, get to Leave this house. Leave this house. Go to your husband's house. Oh, no, I don't know. Go to your husband's house. Go to your husband's house. Go to your husband's house. Wicked woman. Anyway, let me inform you. Those people you hired, those hooligans, they did a good job. Hmm? Thank you. I know you're happy now. You're happy, Abby. He's blind. Hey! What are you saying? Where is my husband? How can you Pretend, accuse me of such? They said it, you are a pretender. Wait, please, I'm here to No. Don't even try it. Amara. The one you did is enough. Amara. Don't even try it. Amara, you should just thank your God that I am a changed person. If not, what I would have done to you, you will not like it. No. Get no. out of my way. Get out of my way. One. I am standing here. Come two. And carry me. I am here to see my you husband. You are not going there to see my love. You want to bribe him more. They want me to. Can the both of you please stop making noise or crying out here that they are patient? Shut up! You! See, I have wounded you. Leave me or I will wound you. I will wound you. No, you are not going anywhere. I will wound you. I will wound you. I will wound you. What are you looking for? Go and find your own husband. He is my husband. Which husband? Has he paid your bride price? Has he paid your bride price? He is my husband. Please, please, please. You ladies should calm down. This is all hospital. Why are you? Why are you shouting? Frank, she is the one. Frank, I am tolerating all this nonsense. She is the one that did everything. I am tolerating. Please. Tell this husband snatcher to go and look for her husband. Oh my, oh my please, Don't please, Ismael, calm down. This is a hospital. This is not what we discuss outside. Please, Amara, mm -hmm. go and get what I told you to get. No, tell her to go. She please. was the one that hired those guys to blind oh, him. Please, stop. Don't all... allow her to go inside. Please, She's both of you should stop. You want to fight, eh? You want to fight, eh? You want to fight. I'm 
come out here. Come. Come, idiot. Come on, I'll give you a Come and disturb my daughter's peace again. You are still walking. Tell her walk. Come inside. Come inside. I'm not here. You want to try into the car? Come now. You idiot. Or check on the I know I'm a car. I'm a chicken. You want to come and disturb my daughter's peace? Idiot. Idiot. I know you are. This Bible, I'm sorry, I didn't even know you were here. Mahalum. I'm not here. Come now! I'm waiting for you. You do not. Where did my daughter even go to? I'm not here. Adi Beribe. Useless fool! Mama, eh? This fight. Hey! This man has strength too. Nah, I need water. Water will be fine, friends. Cold water. What the man does it when I had that? Oh, I. 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 Don't even come back, go! to tell you that the things I need for cooking is not in this house. And I'm so tired. I can't go out now. How can you say you're tired now? Eh? I'm very hungry. Please, I need to eat something. Miko, oh. Ike Mefuna, I'm hungry too. Okay? Stop hammering on this as if you're a child. I told you in a few hours, I'll go out and get those things I need for cooking. A few hours? Yes, a few hours. Uh, you cannot do this to me. Eh, 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 Funa, please, 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 I'm not in for your trouble, please. Amara, please, I, I need to eat and take my medications, please. Eh, please. Pico, eh? if you know you want to rest, at least, just... You know you are not seeing, you are walking around. I am going to the kitchen and go and cook. Yeah, even though you want to you want to rest, you, you can at least go to the market and prepare something for me. Yeah? When you come back, you, you can rest. Please. Yeah? Oh no ma, Biko. Amara. You know, since you are blind, you are sitting down one place. So, I don't need your disturbance. You don't know that somebody is tired. I beg, shift. I want to take selfie. Please. I don't want someone to see a blind man in my picture. Amara. Amara, Biko. Biko. Amara. Please. I'm, I'm, I'm very hungry. My medication is every three, three hours. I've not even taken any since morning. Biko. How are you? I'm fine. You met me well. Come and eat some. <laughs> Hola, you tired or not? Oh, thank you. Um, how is Shima's health? Is the reason I'm here. Oh. 
It's okay now. He even went out with his friends. Hey. Hey, thank God. Thank God it's better. Um, I'll be on my way. Let me go to church. Church? Today is not Sunday now. Which church are you going to? Mama. Yeah. I am going for Bible studies with Pastor David. Bible studies? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> if Naya, you are my daughter. Hmm? And I have noticed some beautiful changes in you, which I am very happy. Eh? Just that I am yet to place my hand on the cause of these beautiful changes. <laughs> I am happy, I am very happy. Well, I have reconciled with the man who truly loves me. And he has changed everything about me. Hey! I said it! <laughs> God will not disappoint me. Eh? Nem, who is this young man? I hope he is handsome. I knew it. I knew it. How is your baby? He's fine. He? Is he a boy? This can't confound with me. Congratulations, my daughter. I said it. I knew that your first child will be a boy. Kandirom kucha. Kakarom kandirom horom kucha. Ikega wondi ashere. Congratulations. Don't worry. You will name him Chima Junior. No. You don't like the name. My Chima can be stubborn at times. I don't want my baby to be stubborn. <laughs> don't worry, when we get to that bridge, we'll cross it. Hmm? Just take care of him for me, oh? Let me be on my way. Well, bye bye. Take care, oh. oh. Take care of that boy inside there. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Chima Junior. Oh, <laughs> oh. Hey, Mama Dirinio. Mama Dirinio. I will look at you and tell you shame. My daughter is pregnant with a baby boy. Hey! I said it. Did I come back or not? Nothing is happening. I have a grand son. God will bless this Naya for me. How is your husband? I don't know. You don't know? Pastor, I am just on my own in that house. No, I don't like how Amara is treating him. She is not taking good care of him. But I cannot interfere or help Ikima out because I am trying to avoid getting into another trouble with him or his sister. But do you still love him? Yes. There is still love in my heart for him. But is hidden under the pains he has caused me. Then he needs grace. Grace? Does he deserve grace? Do you deserve grace? The Bible says, For all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. Christ Jesus died and shed his blood on the cross even when we did not deserve it. And he offers salvation to anyone who would turn to him. So how can you ask God to forgive you when you cannot forgive another? Yet, he did forgive you. 
is not easy. It is not. It is not easy. That's where grace comes in. He gives us grace so that we can be able to give it to others. I had to forgive people in my life. It was not easy, but it freed me. There is no place for struggle between you and God in the throne room of your heart. If you want victory, then you have to completely surrender to God. Go and take care of your husband. Amara! 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 Where could she have gone to? I start to boil water for me. Huh? She just left me. Amara! You mean I've been calling you and you refuse to answer me? Amara! What is it? Ogini! Oh, what happened to the water I asked you to boil for me? Eh? Didn't I tell you I want to take my bath? Boil water for you. As your what? As your maid? Hi. You give me food. Can't you find your way to the kitchen? Is this not your house? Amara. 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 Amara, you know. You know I can't go to the kitchen because of my condition. Stop using your condition as an excuse, Ikemefuna. Chai, Amara. You have suffered though. Amara, clean the house for me. Amara, wash for me. Amara, cook for me. Why? Ikemefuna, why are you punishing me now? Am I the cause of your problem? Am I the cause of your problem? Please. I understand how you feel. But please, be patient for me. The doctor said I will regain my sight very soon. Ikemefuna, stop all these lies and let me be. Amara! 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 Hi! Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm...
I hope you are okay. Um, have you had anything to eat? No. Um, I have some food. I don't know if you would like to eat. Yes. Please. I'm hungry. Thank you. I'll get it for you. I can't do this. I can't. You can't do what? Make me to understand. I can't marry a blind man. Hmm. These two months has been hell for me. I virtually do everything in that house. I don't even have time for my studies. Though the doctor said he's going to be fine, but I'm not seeing any positive improvement in him. Rhoda, please. I can't continue with that relationship. Help me talk to Papa, please. Hmm. Marachi, you know, marriage is a lifetime decision and one has to be careful before going into it. Well, it's okay that now is not paying your bride price and uh, since you cannot handle it, I will talk to Papa about it. He will take care of it. Hmm? Yeah, thank you, brother. Just don't worry, no problem. Yeah. Go in and make me some food to eat. I will, thank you very much. No problem, I will talk to Papa. Okay. Right now. I am not surprised she still loves you. It's obvious that if Anana loves you so much in spite of all. No woman. No woman will ever love me the way she does. Despite all, she has a special place in my heart that no woman will ever occupy. If not for her spiritual issue, nothing will ever make me cheat on her, let alone taking another wife. Talking about her spiritual issue, I don't think that spirit is still disturbing her. I mean, you and I know that she miscarries once her pregnancy crosses five weeks. But she is three months gone. Nothing is happening to her. Rather, she gets stronger and happier day by day. Yes. I, uh, I noticed that too. I noticed that she's always happy. And she prays every night too. I know some things have changed about her. But being free from that spiritual husband, I doubt, Frank. I doubt. Following the recent happenings, I have a strong premonition that she has been delivered from that spirit. Something tells me strongly she is free. Well, aside that, the scan confirmed she is having a boy. Yeah, a baby boy. <laughs> She's having a baby boy? Yeah, very soon you'll be father of a boy. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. You know, I know that God works in miraculous ways which no man can phantom or transcend. Yeah, I know. What matters is looking onto the future and putting the past away. Congratulations once again. Thank you. Thank Just, you, my friend. It's all right. Please take proper care of yourself. It's okay, it's okay. 
I'll be rushing back to the hospital. Mm -hmm. See you soon. Okay. They have a little boy. to tell you is not going to be pleasant in your ear. But I want you to welcome and accept it. Oh. Amara, please, please calm down. It came. Did anyone make you angry? It came. Nobody made me angry. I cannot do this. This relationship will not work. Marriage is a lifetime decision and I cannot handle this. I cannot accept what I can't handle. It came. I'm leaving you. Oh, Amara. Please, you, you can't possibly do this to me. Please. Mama. Ike, you are not going to see again. Forget the doctor's consolation nonsense. You will not see again. Accept that fact. Ike, I'm leaving. I'm leaving you. Don't beg me. I have my bags here already. I pray God give you someone who will love you with this your condition. Amara, I'm leaving you. You can please. Amara. 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 Amara left me. She left me because of my condition. She did not leave you because of your condition. She left because the Lord has stepped in to separate the wheat from the tars. She was never yours. Naya? You came with someone. Who is he? He is my pastor. Brother Ikem, you turned against your wife for fear of the evil spirit that laid claim over her then. And when she tried to take her life due to frustration, the Lord stepped in and showed her salvation. So you don't need to be afraid anymore. Because a greater authority has spelled freedom over her life. And the evil forces that tormented her before have all been dismantled. Ikemefula, go back to your wife and let things return to the way they were. Because 
old things have passed away. And all things have become new. Nanya. My love. Please. Forgive me. I just don't know what came over me. I was captured by fear. Please, my love. Find it in your heart to forgive me. Please. It's all right. I understand and have forgiven you long before now. I am just grateful to God that what the enemy stole from us has been restored. to thank you the God will serve to bless you for coming into my family to bless you another thing my my sight do you think I will be able to see again. There is nothing, absolutely nothing, impossible with God. The person that did this to you, did that out of envy and jealousy. And I see, he will come begging for forgiveness soon. He will. And when he does, you will have to forgive him from the depth of your heart. Yes. After what the person did to me, Pastor, I, I, I do not think I will ever forgive that person. You have to. Because it is written, Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. He came. You have to accept Christ in your heart as your Lord and Savior. Confess your sins to him and beg him for forgiveness. And afterwards, you can lift up your body and son to him. And believe him when he says he can take care of you. And when the day of your miracle comes, your blind eyes will open. Help and build men. Men that will call on the name of the Lord. Men that will not be ashamed. Men that will not cower. Men that will not compromise when under pressure. Men that will always call on the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Help and build men, men that we call on the name of the Lord. Men that will not be ashamed. Men that will not cower. Men that will not compromise when under pressure. Always call on the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. With the same comfort you have been comforted, 
comfort ye others. Look away from your problems and focus on that of others. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. Our society is sick. Jesus is the cure. Thou mighty man of war, pick your sword of truth, which is the word of God, and move. Open to John 3.16 Praise the Lord Hallelujah John 3.16 For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever oh, oh, hold on, hold on. believeth in him uh, For just as God anointed Jesus with Holy Ghost and power who went about doing good ye have been anointed also Apologize for the wrong things that we have done. Hmm? Are we ready? All right. Now hold your hands on your chest. One hand on your chest and one hand up. Hmm? Very good. Are you there? Are you there? Now speak to him and tell him, God Almighty in heaven, do the work of an evangelist. Speak the word. Be instant in season and out of it, healing all that are oppressed of the devil. You are a brand plucked out of fire. Therefore, depopulate hell and let's populate God's kingdom together. Glory. Hallelujah. Amen. No, no, I can, I can go. No, 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 you can't go with us. I can go, Mama, I can go. <laughs> My love, okay? My God is with you. My God will never cease to be with you. At the center of it all is you that I see, is you that I see. At the center of it all is you that I see, is you that I see. I 
I lift my voice and praise It's you that I see It's you that I see There is power in your name I 
Oh my God. I can see. I can see. that God is in control. She delivered a bouncing baby boy. I know. That is why I'm here. Who wouldn't want to witness the arrival of his first child? Especially when the Lord has granted him the privilege to see you with his own eyes. You can see? Yes. I don't know. 